A bench trial continues in the gruesome Phoenix Canal murders. Prosecutors making their case against 49-year-old Brian Patrick Miller, who they believe murdered two young women back in the 1990s. ABC 15's Liz Delia Caballero showing us what happened inside the courtroom. It's been nearly 30 years since the notorious Phoenix Canal murders, and now seven years after detectives made an arrest. Officers saying they have arrested a man, 42-year-old Brian Patrick Miller. The bench trial resumes for now. 49-year-old Brian Patrick Miller charged with murdering 22-year-old Angela Brasso in 1992 and 17-year-old Melanie Burness in 1993. Both were near the Arizona Canal when they were attacked, their bodies mutilated and left out in the open. The prosecution calling Miller's friend to the state and asking questions about a turquoise bodysuit Burnus was wearing when police found her body in 1993. Does this look at all familiar to you? Yes. Why does it look familiar to you? I had seen it earlier amongst his possessions. When did you see it in his possession? It could have been around August of 93. Before Ms. Burnus was killed? Correct. And was this in his belongings at your place? Yes. Prosecutors are wanting to establish Miller is guilty and are seeking the death penalty, but Brian's defense is arguing that he be found not guilty by reason of insanity. What is that video of? That's when we took the whale watching excursion. So you were the one filming? Yes. You were with Brian and Amy and their daughter Sarah? Yes. At some point after that trip, did you have a chance to mention or talk about the trip itself with Brian? Yes. And do you recall whether Brian was able to remember taking that trip or not? He couldn't remember. And what happened after you showed him the video? Uh, he said something to the effect that he still didn't remember it. Miller is being charged with two counts of first-degree murder, two counts of kidnapping, and two counts of attempted sexual assault. This is a bench trial and means there's no jury. It's just a judge. So there won't be testimony every day. Court resumes on Monday. The trial expected to last months. Lustelia Caballero, ABC 15, Arizona.